Hi, I'm Marilyn Demartini with Boat Trader. And we've shown you a lot of boats over the years with big outboards hanging off the back or with big diesel power. But today we're here to totally rethink power and even how we talk about power. We're here with Exshore on the Elex 8000, which is a totally electric boat. It's built in Sweden, and it was built for the hard, cold, choppy waters of Scandinavia, so it can withstand the chop of waters here in the US or North America as well. It has got a very interesting bow shape. It's kind of got a blunt nose on an ax bow with a deep V that flattens out toward the back. This is part of what makes it an efficient boat because when we're talking about power on this boat, we're talking about 170 kilowatt continuous power, which translates to about 230 horsepower. It's also got kilowatt lithium batteries made by Chrysler, so, which is a company that was recently bought by John Deere because of the trend toward electricity. So again, our vocabulary changes, our understanding of speed, but one thing that doesn't change is the feel of power. And you definitely feel that on this boat. When you throttle with a dial, which we'll see when we tour the boat and, and see the helm, which feels totally strange at first, but very comfortable once, you're, once you get used to it. And even though the sound is not guttural, like petroleum-based engines or petroleum power, you feel the power of this boat because you can hear the shafts, you hear the prop, it's got a five blade prop on this boat. So you get the sense of power and even a bit of a sound of power without being overwhelmed by fumes. Let's face it, the movement is going to be away from petroleum to electric and Exshore has shown us how you can make it easy and fun. And easy is one of the key words. We have a hatch here that is a big storage space because this boat is ideal for water sports. You have storage under the steps here. Because of the sustainable conduct code that Exshore has, the floors are all cork, which can be harvested without harming the tree. The top of this boat is lightweight carbon fiber, very strong. So we're gonna take a step further back to the helm and show you a few more of the things that I've been talking about. Let's head that way. So we're here at the helm with Mike Provost from Exshore who is piloting the boat. And you can see how easy it is for him to just feather that dial and control the speed of the boat. There's also three different speed modes for this boat. You've got the power of silence, which is very controlled, cruiser and speedster where you can really open it up. And all of this is done on a special interface that these engines and batteries have with the typical Garmin screen set up. You see there's a 124 inch screen and everything else here at the helm is very clean. You've got a side power bow thruster for docking, leather wheel, everything else is cleared out just for some storage space here. We have storage behind the seat, which pulls down into a, a bolster or seated, however you're comfortable. This boat also has a couple of upgrades in that it has some seating in the aft deck with a teak table that can drop down, have extra padding put in, so it becomes like a bed or a sun pad. This boat is fun and easy. You can go out for a great day of boating with no headaches. So it's an ideal boat for not only somebody who is environmentally conscious, but also somebody who just doesn't want to have to deal with boat maintenance. But the Elex 8000 has been a real treat and a real eye opener in electric powered boats. Thanks for joining us on Boat Trader.